Hello, my name is Abe. Welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Repentance. Uh, let's play another run here. Forgotten Eden Lazarus. We are so close to finishing everything, I can't believe it. Let's do an Eden Greedier mode run. It's even greedier. And let's just see if, oh, we got the Skatol in the key. Skatol and the key. Well, you know what? I'm very glad to see that. That's kind of why I decided to use the key there. And we found some bombs. This is a very good start. <laughs> Friend zone at friendly fly. Is this the fly that just does damage? I'd accept it. Yo, Tech X! Except it doesn't matter because all of our items reroll anyways. So we gotta think. How are we going to handle this? run. I think we should open this. And I think that we should... Yeah, that's right. Uh, I think we should try and... We should definitely just use the sprinkler when it gets recharged, but I, I like this uh, run right now. Uh, we should definitely try to just save our money and then maybe find a cheap item for sale on a future shop, and then we can buy way, 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 way more items with our cash. So it might suck for a little while, but we actually do have like four items to start with, which is, you know, more than you normally start with. I mean, you have to be playing as Eden to even start with uh, the two freebie items. But having the sprinkler, this should be an easy first couple of floors even. I've got a, I've got a good feeling about this, at least I hope. I hope I got a good feeling about this. Just don't get hit, save as much HP as possible. We're gonna take deals with the Angel because um, they're guaranteed to spawn and because they are guaranteed, no! There goes my sprinkler, it actually disappeared. Uh, because they're guaranteed to spawn, it's actually really um, easy to, to get the good items. You know what, get out of here. Oh. oh, you jerk. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I gotta stop taking so much damage. Well, I really wish I had that full heal now. Gotta stop taking this dumb freaking damage. We can't afford it. Also, I really wanted my sprinkler. Where's my sprinkler, please? It's okay, just stop taking damage from here on out. We gotta, we gotta build our health so that we can survive a, a freaking greedier mode fight. Good lord. Okay. Save it all. Use the shears. The shears is gonna help you kill these uh, horrible haunts. Thank you. The damage output from the shears has been nerfed in Repentance, but it's still, uh, still better than nothing. Oh god. Brimstone beams. No, Jesus! There's the brimstone beams. Okay. Haunt is dead, thank you. <laughs> that had to happen. <laughs> this little guy, he's doing it. He's 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 keeping me alive. Dude, if we could spawn two of these on like a future wave, to be able to fly, not have to deal with creep. We might be able to actually handle the caves without getting hit. Although ideally we wouldn't have even gotten hit here, but you can't win them all. It's okay, you got him. You got him. Good, good boy, good boy. Good body. Okay, don't take the deal with the devil. We're gonna wait. Um, let's get the heck out of here. We'll be able to immediately use shears on the next floor. Okay. Why does every item collected get rerolled on Tainted Eden? Or does every item collected? Yes! Every item collected does- there's just a hole here. <laughs> every item collected does get rerolled as Tainted Eden because that's how she operates. Horribly! Yo, Vibrant Bulb is okay. More eyes is not, but it's gonna be rerolled anyways. <laughs> there's the sprinkler again. We don't need to buy a Tears Up right now. We could just wait on it. You know, we have three bombs. Again, we could wait for a future floor where we might be able to afford sale items. The fact that 
there's not a sale item here does not mean that we have to buy stuff. We can still wait. And I, I think we can still wait because of the fact that we've got the shears. And if we double play the shears, we'll have two shears. You know, I think that's that's probably enough extra damage to keep us going for a couple of floors. You know, we've we've done bot, we've done uh, greedier mode run. We know that you need damage and it's hard to come by. But we have a little bit of extra damage. We've got a a friend. He's gonna go murder those guys. Those guys. Uh, those is guys is. You stay there. Just be careful, don't get hit. I'm gonna use the shears again, just so we have two of them out. Although the second shears is a lost body shears. That's kind of cool. I thought I, I thought I, I think I remember noticing that once in the past. Oh, thank you. They're so good, <laughs> they're so good. Yeah, this is a, this is a really good item to have, I'm realizing. Sprinkler, sprinkler is nice, but sprinkler can't target. It's got range, but it can't target, so it, it ends up doing damage a little bit more slowly. I think two shears is probably enough. Oh, there they go. Yum, 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 yum. Eat up Envy. Go get the chub. He's a chub man. Eaten by a body. Beautiful. Get those in there. We can just kind of hang back because I don't think this guy can hit us if we hang back. He can. He can try. Excuse me. I got one of them in. That's good enough. That's a body. Oh, you got to eat immediately. Beautiful, dude. What a what a good floor. Now, which one of these do we want? They're all, they're gonna get rerolled, so I think we go soul locket to get value immediately because it'll drop a spirit heart and then the spirit heart will give us a bonus. Damage and tears up. That's okay. I think we also do want to fight the angel. It's the blue one, which is good. But I think we want to get those key pieces so we can keep the um, the angel items coming. You know, we want to we wanna stock up as many as possible so that when we take damage, um, we reroll into good angel items, so we just want as many of those as possible. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna buy maybe like two keys, and then we'll move on. I don't think we need to, uh, I don't think we need to buy anything else. Yeah, we could buy some tiers upgrades, but we wanna buy cheap items. Those are too expensive. These are also still too expensive, but we might take um, something just so that we are, aren't stuck with like money and no items. I'd rather have items and no money. Let's take speedball. Cricket's body is very good. Nice little tears up as well. Um, so you know what, I will take, oh, you know what, there's a reroll machine. Just reroll until there's a sale item. Or a good item. No, nah, reroll until there's a sale item. Is there ever gonna be a sale item? Jeez, um, ugh. I'll do one more. There we go, there we go, there we go. So you get Tarot Cloth, Hero Font. That is Bone Hearts. I think we will... What the heck? That's a lot of Bone Hearts, but we don't need that many of them. We'll take Pandora's box and just use it. I mean, that's a lot of money. What is happening? <laughs> we'll take pay to play. It gives us money back too. It's passive. It's an active. If I use it, it's gonna hurt us. So let's not use it. Let's just grab the nine volt, which we should have been holding on to pinking shears. Dude, I actually think that 
pause is a great item. I think that pause is, is magnificent. We gotta go two waves until we get a charge, but we'll just we'll just wait. Because pause in theory just allows me to to stop enemies and then let my uh, my oh god you have no body lets my friends do all the work for me. It's just a, he's just a walking tarot cloth. Do you see that? It's beautiful. Oh, time is still going. What the heck? The, it lied to me. Time isn't stopped. It's relative. Time is a flat circle. I guess if we if we need to, we can always just pause. Though it's a little awkward when time doesn't actually slow down. Are you guys like doing your job? Enemies are still alive here, I'm noticing. Oh, you know what? We can just switch over to to pause to get a damage bonus too. If we need to pause due to a, a tough boss, we will. But so far, we don't have to. I got one body in there. Oh, they're all in there. Dude, look at him. <laughs> no is always the answer. If if we get hit. It's not gonna matter, but a no trinket would be kind of nice. What I'd actually like, though, is I would really like a, um... Sorry, I'm trying to just dodge here. I'd really like a, uh, I mean, a holy mantle, obviously, but... I'd like a 4.5 volt. We get 4.5 volt, we can use the shears and the pause button multiple times on Greedier, and he should be very easy to kill. So we don't want Genesis. I don't think we want Circle of Reflection. I think we want the, uh, the Miter, we can only hold one Spirit Heart. I think we will go Circle of Protection. Did I say Reflection? I guess that's kind of what it does, it reflects. So it's not... Ask ah, it, I'll take the other Bone Hearts. Just so we have them. And, um... I don't think we want anything else. I think I will get stapler, even though it is expensive. Then we'll leave. I'm kind of of the uh, opinion of why not take it, because we just haven't been taking any damage. So Miter Soul Locket doesn't really work, because we have to get hit in order to create space for the soul hearts, and if we get hit, we lose the ability to um, to get a benefit from them because we'll reroll our items, so it's, it doesn't really matter actually. Okay, tough love is fine. PJs are fine. No damage bonus because of Soul Heart, but we did fill all of our Bone Hearts, which is actually amazing now that I think about it. That's very good. I am perfectly happy with that. This is a this is a weirdly like great run. Careful, 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 careful. Oh, Jesus. Pause if you have to. That range up might have been a good buy on the last floor. Be careful, you could get um, brimstone ghosts here, which is highly annoying to deal with. I think I did see, you know what? I think that's a pause. I want to get in here and uh, kill these enemies, which are highly annoying. Ooh. Jerks. They're getting got. Oh, God. Every time I look away, there's just more dudes. I don't know if I'm doing damage or if they're doing damage, but I'm liking it either way. 
You know what, these guys are still okay. I know they were nerfed, but they're still kicking ass. Okay, this boss sucks though, because it's hard to hit. He's not that hard though, this is hard to hit. You know what? I think that's acceptable. Although, not all of them are getting in there and doing damage, unfortunately, but as long as we're doing something, I'm happy. Ah, oh, there we go. Also, perfection. <laughs> I mean, honestly, we should take it, because now we have Teeth Shot, so... Really? You're gonna give me a deal with the devil? Who needs it? Who frickin' needs it? We have perfection. That is stupid, but also kind of funny. Let's um take a quick moment to reroll, see what we get. We don't need clicker, don't need plan C, it doesn't even work, don't really need the luck. HP up. Birthright. Dude, okay. I I I know what birthright does. I know what birthright does, and we are going to take it. It wins us the run. What birthright does is it locks in your current run. From this point forward, we will not reroll anything unless we pick it up after Birthright. Birthright is a safe, it is a vault, and we can put this run into the vault. This run is very good, so I'm gonna put this run into the vault and we're gonna lock it in place. We will never lose paws, we will never lose shears, we will never lose uh, the health that we currently have, the damage that we currently have, the teeth, Lock it in, and Soul Lock it is gonna be permanent too. So we could, if we wanted to, take damage and then pick up uh, Blue Hearts if they spawn. So, lock it in. It's beautiful. It's been done. Good Lord, that's amazing. <laughs> that's fan flippin tastic And now just get the heck out of here. Oh, you know what? It rerolls trinkets. Ah, oh, we lost the trinket. It also rerolls the pill. Okay. Well, you know, you know what? Fair enough. We know that. Actually, I think fuse cutters is very good. But, uh, but okay. So perfection will get rerolled because it's a trinket. But everything else is still the same. And even though we lost some of our teeth shot, it doesn't matter because we actually. Um, like, our teeth aren't doing the damage. The bodies are doing the damage. Cards. I think we'll just get one card. You know what? I screwed it up. We will now lose Pinking Shears if we get hit, because I put it down and picked it back up. I think. Which is a shame, because I want to play those guys, but really don't think we should now. Hanged Man. So that's a, that's a greed. Definitely worth taking and using. Hot pepper is again it's worth taking, but we're gonna reroll anyway, so I don't know if we wanna. Teeth got pulled rip. Yes, So in theory, um we'll get some random coins for enemies when we kill them now. For the rest of this well for like the next two minutes or something, so we should be able to get some extra cash out of this. Brimstone ghosts have to go. I know we should be pausing more often, but... I don't want to make it harder on myself to figure out what's going on. You know, these guys get paused. They suck. Are there more of them? Freaking more of them. Look at the amount of money that we're getting from this. That's amazing. That one just says Isaac on it. Do you see that? <laughs> the one that's holding the box just says Isaac. That's funny. Okay. We still have our um, quad shot. Because the, the tarot cloth doubled it, so it doubled the, the length of it. Uh, it just wore out. Still, we got, a, we got a lot of money for using that hangman card. And if we can get 4.5 volt, like, this runs over. The boss won't be able to do anything. Greedier mode boss, he's gonna get screwed by pause if we can get 4.5 volt. Or even just like a battery would be nice.
We have 64 cents. It's very good. I think we should take the soul. Although it will probably get rerolled anyways. Um, and I don't think we take... No, we should reroll. We should. We've got the money. You know, I look at this and I say, okay, what if we red stew and then quickly do the next couple of floors? But I don't think we want to go that fast. I think we want to want to slow down a little bit. Speed up. We don't really need it. The cards would probably pay for themselves, but... Let's just keep going. Spider mod is okay. Take the deck of cards and play those judgments. That's a that's actually a very good point. We'll lose the box and the soul, but like who cares? Okay, so we want the battery. So I think at this point, let's let's do that. Let's pick up deck of cards and then let's play these guys to try to get some payouts out of them. <laughs> right? We have another judgment card. Which gives us a reroll pedestal. Interesting. Anarchist cookbook. Which is also interesting. Gave us a black heart, which is okay. We're back to the soul now. We got another judgment, which gave us more judgments. All right, this is getting a little out of control. High Priestess times two. This was a very good idea. <laughs> this was a very good idea. I don't even know if I want to play you. I'll play you. Ace of Clubs. Plus suplex. The devil. Plus deck of cards. Which gives us a temperance. Which gives us two demon judgments. Alright, this is getting a little out of control. We, al we also have holy mantle. Oh, dude. I had godhead? Well, now I have holy mantle. So now is the, que now is the question. Do we try to keep re-rolling to get like... Uh... Uh, Godhead or Sacred Heart or something, or do we keep playing these judgments? Because we have three of them. Stop here? You crazy? Like we can we can buy as much health as we want. Here's the thing. Wheel of Fortune? Question mark. That that randomly does something. Soul of Apollyon. That's just flies. That's okay. The heck is this? Oh, this is the uh, the orb. The sacred orb improves the quality of all items that you get. So if I reroll this room, we should get items that are of a high quality. So that's an interesting one. But also, reroll. Now we got Revelation, which is very good. But let's keep rerolling. Now we got Godhead again, which is still good, but let's keep rerolling. Now we got Queen of Hearts, which when we use it, is go going to allow us to play this guy for a lot longer. <laughs> and also, hey look, the nail! Also the D20, which is kind of cool. Um, but we'll play you. Keep playing you. We got another Judgment. Judgments. Oh my god. We're like going infinite off of one room, which is just dumb. Can I can I get another card, by the way? Was there another card here at some point? No. I don't want to reroll the battery, because the battery is gonna be important. We'll try to get when we're down to like one judgment, we'll try to get back to a holy mantle, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Chariot, which is not what we're looking for. Oh, hey, it's another one of those. Uh, I don't know what two is going to do for us, but that's okay. Tainted Eden, Eden is the last character I thought you would go infinite with. <laughs> that's It's weird, isn't it? But we, we're actually able to constantly generate 
new pills and cards by just getting hit. Our run is locked in. Now we have Whore of Babylon. Now we have the wafer. We can't take it though. Don't need it. Justice. That's a that's a use. Gives us more HP. Get hit again. Hanged man. Don't need it. Two of clubs. Don't really need it, but let's keep it on the ground for a moment. It's a horse pill. Don't know what it does. Let's reroll. We got the fool card. Oh, we also got Star of Bethlehem. How are you doing today? And the goober shots. I like goober shots. By the way, goodbye. What the heck is this? Judgment. It's more reroll pedestals. <laughs> oh my god. The Empress. I still have a pill item. He died. Found soul. Got another fool card. Fool card. Lovers. Well, that's a use. Give us a new card, which is the Magician. I like the Magician. Let's reroll. Um, I like the Empress. Empress, too. Didn't mean to do that. Priestess. Ace of Hearts. Actually, turning all of these into hearts. F it. Ace of Hearts. You know what? There's some bonus stats right there, too. <laughs> there we go. All right. Reroll it again. Mom's a bottle of pills. All right. Fair enough. So now, I guess we'll use it to get some pills. So now we can take these items or re-roll them, but I don't want to ever get hit ever again on the, at this point in the run. So what I'm thinking is we'll re-roll, and it all turns into boss items, which is actually still perfectly fine, and probably actually better than the alternative, because now if we get hit, we'll just re-roll them into good items, instead of possibly things from a demon judgment that could get us killed. So it's, that's very strange, but I, I think that's okay. And I, I kind of want to ruin a bone heart so I can take these HPs. And these are all going to get rerolled if I leave anyway, so we'll just do this. Oh, we had Holy Mantle now. Whatever. Well, actually, if we can leave through a secret room, oh, then we wouldn't lose Holy Mantle. But I don't care about losing Holy Mantle. It doesn't matter. I think we want, we want to get hit, you know, we can just do it here on the fire. There's no fire, never mind. I think we want to get hit one more time. Fool card, reroll the pill. What do we got? Divorce papers, decent, decent tears up. We're pushing some of the bone hearts out of the rotation, but I think it's it's okay. What do we got here? We got an we got an angel. I think I had flight for a bit there. I think I lost my flight abilities. You know what? Screw it. Just pick them up. We want these to be ruined anyway, so we can get more stat bonuses later. We're very slow. I don't want to be this slow. We have Jesus fish. I don't want Jesus fish. <laughs> We have another syringe. We have a luck up. Co oh, stairway to heaven. Dude, the stairway to heaven. That's where we stop. That's where we stop. Because the stairway to heaven is so good. Don't don't play him. We don't need to play him. So now we're going to get the shears again. Never, ever take damage ever again because we will lose the effect of the shears. But pick up the battery. Um, And then we will go ahead and blow this guy up. Go ahead and blow this up. No secret room, unfortunately. Oh, we don't even access the HP. Uh, let's leave. Let's get out of here now. Because we will get a stairway on the next floor now. 
which will give us more angel items, I hope, which will hopefully turn into more angel items when we get hit. Cliff of Balance. Gave us a little bit of HP, Cliff of Balance is totally acceptable. Judgment. I don't know what you can give me, but hopefully it's acceptable. To me. Magician. Magician, if we can hold it for the next floor would be best. Still looking for a 4.5 volt, by the way. We'll we'll check on this floor. Hope, hope that we can get one. Okay. Better tier rate. Tiers are fine. Gave us dinner, which is perfectly okay. Hopefully it re-rolls back into some more dinner. Uh, then... Check the shop. No idea what the items are. Okay, go. Sure, fine. Uh, let's do this. It's gonna be uh, a bit awkward to start while we're building up our, our army. And we need to make sure that we have enough charges that we can use this twice on the boss fight. So I'm not going to use it again. What we should do is we should use stop some more. Just to make sure that we are taking as little damage as possible. Oh god. We got him? We almost got him. Oh, but the the spike traps didn't go away. Now they went away. I'd also like to have um, pause double charged. Uh, but we'll we'll get it charged after this wave because this sucks. <laughs> so we we only had two familiars um during this wave here, but that's that's okay with me, dude. Just make sure um, the bloat has been dead. It's been killed. Dude, I hate this trinket that we have. <laughs> Can I not have fart trinket, please? It makes it annoying picking up all the pennies. This is a classic wave. No real need to use pause. We've seen that before. Well, we'll take seven seals. Hey, you know what? It's another item we can reroll into if we ever get hit. So we've got two charges ready to go. The infinity is not what we want. Battery pack, not what we want. Okay, well, <laughs> that, that's it then. That's all she wrote. Let's get the heck out of here. With pause, with the damage that we have. Oh, I wish I had money. Oh, I really wish I had money. <laughs> I am a fool. I, I forgot that we didn't get hit, that's the thing. Whatever. Also, no 4.5 volt, but that's okay. Ah, the pain. Eh, we'll be fine. What? That is so BS! <laughs> we have revelation at least, but that is so BS! I didn't realize his hitbox got bigger. I have 4.5 volt. Yeah, but like, I don't have anything to use with it. Pause isn't really worth anything right now. Because I don't have my familiars anymore because I got a hit. What a what an annoying turn of events that was. <laughs> I didn't realize his freaking hitbox would get that big. I just, I wanted to get my uh, my friends in close and then I would run away and then pause later. I didn't want to pause immediately. It's okay. 
I think we still got it, because, like, we have health, and we know that some of our run is not going to ever change. A, a large portion of our run is not going to change. We're going to sometimes get new, um, boss items. Like, whatever, fine. Sweet, I guess. He's half dead. Our friends would have done a better job of killing him, though. I guess we could still pause and, like, use the Meat Boy, but, like, who cares? I could use the D8, I guess. Oh my god, he's so fast. <laughs> Try to, like, increase our stats. You know, that increased our damage quite a bit. I like it. We're a lot slower, though. Ah, oh, there it goes. Okay. Now what do we have? Still have Revelation and Car Battery, which doesn't really do all that much. No auto damage yet. We have the Blanket. I don't know if it's going to be charged right now. Like, maybe it's not charged because we've already, you know, we, we turned into the Blanket during the fight or something, but... Careful, dude. Careful. Poke someone's eye out. So many freaking keys. It's okay. Just, you know, take your time. He's dead. Phase 2 is easier than Phase 1, really. Find him. He's up here somewhere. No, he's right. Oh, he was right there. Just keep hitting him. Keep hitting him. Oh, hello. You jumped a little quickly there, dude. Just use use pause if you have to dodge. That's the thing. Can't believe we didn't get hit there. Dude, we got him. Easy. The world has appeared in the basement. I got no idea. But ultimately, that wasn't that bad. We got hit like twice or something. Beautiful. Might as well get hit to reroll in the Sacred Heart, Godhead. Nope. That was a fun run. <laughs> that was a good run, and uh, now Eden has her greedier mode run completed. So we have all, I think we have all but one of the tarot cards now. Fantastic, let's go. That was a fun run. Ooh, uh, uh, Forgotten is like the last one that we have to do of uh, Lazarus. Uh, it was a good run. You know, it, it, it was very good once we were able to buy Birthright. Technically, we didn't have to buy it immediately. We could have rerolled and then bought Birthright after we rerolled in something good. But I really liked the run that we had and I wanted to keep the um, active items. But when you put down an active item and then you pick it back up, that counts as a new item and it won't be locked in. So that's why we kept holding on to pause, and then the other item was re-rolling every time we took damage. So, unfortunately, we were not able to use our uh, meaty body friends during Greed Fight, but we got through it anyways. Fantastic. For those of you on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Like the video if you've enjoyed it. Subscribe for more. Check me out on Twitch for when I go live. Support me on Twitch, Patreon, and Streamlabs, and I hope to see you here again for the next run of The Binding of Isaac Repentance.